all right what's good people welcome back to another 2k21 next gen video today i'm showing y'all how to use the shot stick man a lot of people been asking me how are you so good with the shot stick i'm about to let y'all know man it's really not that difficult you know what i'm saying even though i didn't green that hold on, hold on. All right, okay there we go i gotta show y'all how to center that thing how to shoot it well i'm tripping right now listen this is my first it's my first time shooting today but you see oh look at that range all right so i'm gonna show you all the basics and everything so if you're new here make sure to like the video you know subscribe to the channel all that good stuff with that being said let's get right into it now first of all a prerequisite you want sniper the sniper badge if you are playing current gen you have no idea what i'm talking about it's not in current gen only on next gen but if you're on next gen you want the sniper badge bro it boosts your aiming to well aimed shots something like that that's the description of it you need it trust me it makes a difference it makes a huge difference all right and then the second prerequisite is you're going to want players that have a good good rating good shooting ratings now you're not going to be out here you know centering easily with people that have like a 73 ball or like a 70 mid-range 80 mid-range you're going to want them to be like close to the 90s all right now they can have like an 85 or something and higher but if you want to be consistent you want them to be like 90s bro so i'm gonna break this down step by step to what i do all right so first of all um there's different situations where you're going to catch the ball and shoot so i'm going to do it off dribble right now so you see i'm dribbling then i'm just gonna pull it bang you know excellent center all right then there's the catch and shoot wait i drip i took a dribble hold on there we go catch and shoot all right and then i'm gonna be running off the dribble you know what i'm saying fades easy still not patch we need that 2k and then there's layups all right so okay i dunked right there this is a great tutorial by the way make sure to like it um and there's layups there you go okay the way you pull the stick down is going to be different for everything you do all right but the thing that stays the same is you're going to want to stay in the center all right you're going to want to pull it as close to the center as possible with the right timing now just look just look at the way i'm pulling the stick down i'm not flicking it right i'm just gently you know what i'm saying pulling it down I'm not doing this because that is it, a little bit harder to time when you do that and you shoot faster the faster you pull it down the quicker you shoot the slower you pull it down the slower you shoot all right it's kind of like quick draw but not really because it doesn't affect your release to that degree but it does make you shoot uh quicker or slower depending on how fast you flick the stick down just look at my just look at my thumb the way i'm pulling it down man you just want to do it just like that all right simple simple all right so right now i'm gonna change the settings to show y'all because i think it's on pro right now oh it's on all-star okay i'm putting it on superstar because i'm about to start using this right here this this left trigger to shoot now those last couple shots i took as you saw it just said center because i wasn't using the left trigger to shoot but you can also use the left trigger to time your shots and then you use the right stick go down to aim now it sounds very complicated but it's really not all right so you know how when you shoot with x right or a square button you're basically doing that with the left trigger all right like i said it sounds complicated but once you get used to it it's not complicated at all right so you will you will have to know how to shoot all right i should have said this as another prerequisite you gotta know how to shoot if you can't shoot with the button then shot stick it might be kind of hard because you just trying to center all the time is not gonna work and freestyle it works because i'm open but when you take kind of contested shots you're gonna want to do both all right it's going to be way easier to hit shots when you try to time as well as aim all right so once you get you know you're timing down with the button all right you can go ahead and transfer that little jamal murray is so good bro i'm sorry let me not get sidetracked you're gonna want to start doing the left trigger as well as the stick all right so as you see now it says slightly early slightly left because i'm using both now and i'm off right now hold on i'm off i'm off i'm off i'm off i'm off there we go come on money mall you got a hit for me let me green that real quick the timing for the left trigger is a little bit different than the button it's like you have to time it just a little bit later like just a little bit 
as you see i'm still shooting late bro and i'm not shooting well right now at all hold on there we go that was still late maybe it's earlier maybe i'm tripping okay there we go i got an excellent jesus christ i'm looking like a scrub out here okay there we go one thing about moving from the button to the about from the uh, x button to the left trigger is the timing is, is a little bit different so something you kind of get used to once you start using the stick but look at me okay i'm still going i'm still going all right so yeah it's something you really just got to practice bro i mean i can't i can't tell you you know just do this it's not like speed boosting like oh you just hit the stick and then you do that you know what i'm saying like you got to practice it bro you got to get a feel for it i've been shooting with the stick since the freaking demo came out in september all right or august whenever the demo came out so you know i've been doing this for a while bro i've been doing this for months so it kind of you know it's just easy for me fades fades are the easiest shot if you use a shot stick bro um you really don't have to use the shot stick for it to be easy but you can use the button but you, you just have so much time to aim your shots and you know shoot that it's just easy bro like you literally i have all day look at that i got all day oh and uh floaters are easy too bro that's another thing if you want to start adding floaters to your game oh yeah look at that center easy you don't even have to you don't even have to uh, time that you just got to aim it and it's gonna work trust me now if you want to just do try to do it with the aiming and not the button um you know you can do that but i would suggest the button trust me because when you get in online the button and the uh aiming is going to be the way to go but if you feel like the button is messing up your centering then just keep practicing centering first because there's no point of you messing up both you know you want to be good at both you don't want to be bad at both so get one down at least really good and then try to you know use the aiming and the button at the same time now let me try somebody else let me show y'all the difference between somebody that's really good versus somebody who's just okay so who's the worst shooter on my team that's not a bronze all right here we go so now we got deandre ayton in right and it's gonna be it's gonna be more difficult no it's not i'm lying <laughs> i'm lying but as you kind of see like the the blue window is a little bit slower i mean a little bit smaller and there's more stick resistance you can't see it i can see it because i'm right next to the screen but if I'm moving left, sometimes it'll just move back to the right for no reason. But I'm greening right now, slick. Oh, I'm greening right now, slick. Okay, DeAndre Aiden, I, know, I didn't know you was like that. I didn't know you was like that. But right there, right there. So I tried to move right, and it, it just bounced back left. So, yeah, if you're not a great shooter, sometimes it'll just move for no reason, bro. But I'm greening right now. What the heck? this is outrageous i didn't even know he can shoot like this i thought he only had like an 83 ball bro he is sparking these things oh my goodness okay yeah i don't think there's really anything else to say y'all just gotta practice bro like that's how i got good at it I, I just kept doing this stuff bro like i said i've been doing this since the demo came out so you know you just gotta practice it thank you for watching this video i appreciate it make sure to like comment subscribe all that good stuff with that being said I'll see y'all on the next video.